Hello folks, welcome to my Left 4 Dead myth hunting video. This is another video by GMGO and we're gonna meet uh, hunt some myths from the game. Begin with the red car's alarm. You know when you shoot the red car sounds alarm. I'm gonna shoot the boomer next to the red car because I think it will sound the alarm by dying the boomer next to the red car. So the survivor, the one is above, is going to crouch and carefully shoot the boomer to see if the sounds the alarm off, but it doesn't. As you can see, the alarm was not sound. But let's try it again because I think I was too far away. Let's try that again. If I get close enough, I shoot the boomer without shooting the red car. So I carefully aim to the head of the boomer, avoiding the red car. And when I kill the boomer, the sound of calm alarms goes off, of alerting the order. So it works. Why and long distance doesn't work? I don't know, but if you check it, I can shoot the red car from really great distance and it won't sound alarm. As I get closer, there's a separate point, uh, it will sound alarm. Usually when I'm on the straight there, here, I'm gonna sound alarm now. As you can see, distance that's considered. So now that I'm close range again, I'm gonna try to see if the kill exploit on the console for the boomer works, but doesn't. So you have to kill legitimately the boomer. The results are, the real alarm car activates only when the survivor is near it. A boomer explosion near the red car does set off the alarm, provided the survivor is close enough, of course and the kill in the console doesn't work, so you have to kill legitimately the boomer. Now let's try something else, relocating the wedge. Now with the hunter you can puzzle the witch on the right corner and uh, the right angle and with some luck she will follow you pissed off trying to kill you. When she does kill you, this new location is where she's going to stay, so you can relocate the witch by doing this. <laughs> One thing to note is that the witch will not attack the survivors if you take the witch to the survivors. What is possible though, if that if the witch kills you and she's too close to the survivors or the survivors just shoot at her because they are scared well she's going to be pissed off to the survivors as well. So here she comes and I'm going to kill myself with the kill command so the witch relocates right here and the witch is going to stay here. Look, watch the second player on the split screen below, side so move uh, through the level, I'm going to see if the witch stays there. And from a place where it could be easily avoidable, the witch is now in a much more dangerous position. So the result is that you can relocate the witch with uh, using the hundred pounds, but take a couple of pounds, sometimes random at the right angle. Now, can it affect the damage to witch? That's another question we may have or not. So we decided to also myth hunt this one. Can we do damage with the special infected by attacking the witch or not? Now, the hunter does 10 hit points, so I'm going to spawn a switch with 10 hit points. I should be able to kill with the hunter only with one hit, <coughs> provided I do damage. So, I'm going to spawn the witch, and I'm going to attack her. Now, she doesn't die, but I'm going to keep attacking just in case, and she does die. Which means that I do damage the witch, but it does less damage than the survivors, because it took me 3 hits to kill a 10 hit points witch. So, there you have it. You can damage the witch, but it takes less damage than survivors. Now, let's see if another uh, last myth we're going to do today is the pissing off the witch on survivors. It is possible or not. Now, I was told that if you hit the hunt with a hunter on a witch, she will go and attack on nearby survivors by just hitting with melee. Now, the survivor is nearby there and attacking, and she does nothing. Now, what happens if I get close enough? It gets the witch attention, and the witch is pissed off when I melee here. Wow, amazing, huh? That really works. Don't worry, I'm a godmother right now, so as you can see, the witch can't kill me. So I'm gonna take my time and kill her calmly. Now, let's try again. <coughs> I'm gonna just spawn another witch. And what I'm gonna do now is to see as I get close. And then I'm gonna try to run away. Now it got my attention and I attack her. She really pisses off. But she's not going to attack me because I'm really away. So what the hunter really does, by milling the witch, she gets really pissed off. But she doesn't trigger her yet. In order to trigger her, you must be near her. So if you are near the witch and she gets your attention, the moment someone attacks the witch, she's coming right after you. Unless of course you get away in time before the attack of the melee actually does happen. So as you can see, 
The witch gets my attention. I don't run away, but I attack the witch. She gets pissed off at me. That's really work. But okay, remember I have uh, God mode, so don't worry. Now, let me finish this trial here and let's try something else because, I mean, the hunter does this, but what about other special effects? So let's try with the boomer. Something really similar we can try here, but with the boomer this time. Now I'm gonna approach the witch and I'm gonna tr attack with, with a melee attack from the boomer. And she is really pissed. As you can see, she stands up really mad. But why didn't she came after me? Because I got away in time. I got her attention, but I got away in time. Now, if I get her attention, the boomer attacks her, and I'm still getting there at her attention, I'm gonna get attacked by a witch. So that's really work. Now let me try uh, another thing I like to see is, what about the boomer's explosion? Does a uh, boomer dying uh, provoke a witch or not? So I'm gonna try to shoot the boomer from here in a safe distance. And, well, according to the subtitles, the witch is a bit pissed off, but not entirely. So it does affect a bit. But let's try again. Let's spawn the boomer again. Poor player one. So we're going to move the, the boomer above the player, the first player, next to the witch. I'm going to try to kill her. To, sorry, not to her, the boomer. I'm going to try to kill him. While I get the boo the witch's attention and she does piss off of me. So killing the boomer does piss her off, but it's in a similar way to attacking with melee. If you're getting her attention, you will get her immediately. So for the final results we have the following. First you can piss off the witch by attacking her with any infected melee, smoker, boomer or hunter, and the survivor must have gotten her attention first. This means she's growling uh, and like showing anger against the survivor but not going after him or her yet. When you attack at that moment she pisses off. If the survivor gets her attention but then gets away, attacking her only angers up. She stands up, but she's not uh, going after the survivor, not yet. And the boomer death does set off the witch, provided the survivor has her attention as well. 